out of Osaka aircraft carrier docked in Night City called Kujira or the Whale. Apparently the corp figured it wasn't safe in Japanese waters, afraid some local fishermen might harpoon it for scientific research. But honestly, it's quite the power move. Wonder what Militech will respond with. Maybe Myers will fly a rust bucket B-17 flying fortress over Arasaka HQ. Ooh, man, that's, that is insensitive. I am so sorry, where are my manners? President Myers, I mean, of course. <laughs> Gotta respect the office. Anywho. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to another episode. Ah, uh, you remember I left today, my cream. And as always, your business is my business. We'll kick off the day with a broad scan of the market. Kiroshi climbs two. Quadra tips by one. New American Auto Works ripped up by one and a half. But the day is the head turner. Damn. Orbital air rocketing by 10 points. So many Don't drugs, bro. Volume. You heard right. 10 points. But what? Coming off a disappointing year, no new announcements. The release of longtime CEO Leslie Moore. Oh, 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 you get it. What the oh, hell? Oh. Oh, uh, never mind. Never mind. Let's not watch TV. <laughs> Yeah, this is how I looked yesterday, guys. Hi, guys. Um, I wanna change my clothes.
I don't know if I just transfer them to my... It reminds me a little bit of Watch Dogs. <laughs> No. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. You could even call me a collector. Later, V. the likes of V. <laughs> so how about it? How's it going? Fight's about to start. Not gonna watch? Take notes? Malone versus Hernandez? <laughs> nah. Our chrome friend here don't watch TV. Don't talk neither. Only way he communicates is with them this. Let's do this. Let, let me try. Not I do Keep that head moving. Oh. Let's do this. Ah! 
Let's have a look. Oh, I love me a shotgun, bro. Can I get this? I have enough money, right? Yeah, I can get this. Equipped. Uh, I don't know if you're not pretty. Mm. Yeah, I'm broke. I'm a good man. Wait, what? I actually got the shotgun. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Can I, um, hold on.
Red Menace, Purple Force, it's us, Crash! News, we wish you a safe and fun Matsuri. Enjoy yourselves, Night City. Cyber Psychosis, Myth or Reality. Stay tuned. So. Going on in this city, bro. Mm. Man of the hour. <laughs> Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens. I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated coup. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal is right on you now, I see. All right, let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong, don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias a Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Yeah, wait. I hope I get to drive you, bro. Stop. Ripper Duck. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Me and Misty. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know?
this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. Sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little kitchen up to do. You look pleased. Vicky, surprise. Every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neurosocket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Whole kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Me tactic can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You here? All right, thanks, man. That gonna be so bad, bro. Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Corroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now check in. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy, then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this... I'd be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. me to change a part of my body from to cortex bra 
Ocular system. What the fuck is ocular system? Who's a doctor in this bay? If I have a doctor watching my videos, please advise me. Oh, these are my hands. So it lights up. I can literally replace my immune system, bruh. Cellular system, I will avoid him. Okay, let's see. My heart, I can't even afford it. <laughs> <coughs> Damn. Okay, let me see. I can't afford shit, man. Unless for the hands, right? Shit, I wanna replace my eyes guys. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your faces a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. That major league arm of yours right here. God damn. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town. But been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Oh man, he's gonna hop, now, bro. a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. For real, bro? You're Feel cutting anything? my hand? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky gannic hand. Could slip. Lights Shit. out for a minute, all right? He's about to remove my eye. Oh, man. Oh, man. Ah, ah, ah. Ah. Oh, okay. It wasn't as painful as I thought, bro. Still, bro. That's crazy, man. I don't even know what's happening right now, but it's so okay, fucking crazy. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Whoa. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Seen more dramatic improvements before. Patience, kid. Give it a minute.
Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. It auto worked like a charm. Oh, damn. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Well, thanks, man. Shit, You're Victor, not beat. bad. I don't know what to say. Say so you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull on. Me? I'm trying to leave. I'm sorry, bro. Okay, I'm back. Talk. What was I? Oh, right. Now every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% of every blow. Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh... How's Biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corporals learn to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. Good thing you got Misty here to help. Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. You know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with this lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. 
the number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. Your joy, your worries, your life. For them it is all mere spectacle. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Need a push in the right direction. Data 
a pack of condoms bro Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. <clears throat> okay. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Go on. Would you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? some sort of test eh, just a pet topic of mine you mean riddles no mr. V ontology all right listen close scanning a serious job now playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home let me hear it what's the job there's this prototype tech a biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. Sure. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Client, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. 
told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Okay. Yours I'm truly here. will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy. What's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Okay, good job. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Jackster, talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick, hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> Chingon. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So... How you want to play this? 
Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. Orale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Hey, okay guys, I'm actually feeling a little bit sleepy right now. And uh, I think I'm gonna end the episode here, man. Uh, next time I'll come back and track this job, guys. Till next time, peace.